A beautiful but windy May night at Barney Swinehart Field was the backdrop for Mac Red girls soccer action as your 7-0-1 Eisenhower Eagles sit in second place as they take on the first place in undefeated Anchor Bay Tars. The game would be physical from the start as number four Megan Sidaway delivers a big hit here. Sidaway would then get a scoring chance off the inbounds pass, but she sends it off the side of the net. And more physical play from the Eagles as number 21 Sarah Falloon makes the aggressive stop on defense. The Eagles again with a scoring chance, but number 11 Nina Ferrero misplays the ball in the offensive zone. The Tars would finally get their first scoring chance of the game as number three Jessica Schneider delivers a stretch pass deep into the offensive zone but number 10 Grace Wolf can't track it down in time and Madison Marks makes the easy save. Ike now with a free kick opportunity as number 14 Micah Ingles rips one off the crossbar. Anchor Bay would counter with a free kick of their own but Falloon makes the impressive defensive play. Then number two, Carly Barone, forces a pass ahead to her sister number 13, Riley Barone, but she can't track it down in time. And that would do it for the first half of play as we remain scoreless. And now in the second half, Lauren DeBow would get taken down here for her efforts, setting up the Eagles with a free kick opportunity. And Sidaway would take the free kick, sending it into the box. But Allie Gaunt makes the save, despite the contact from number 22, Emma Campbell. The Tars would get another scoring chance, but it's sent way over the crossbar. Ingles would then get the inbounds pass from number eight, Grace Pabian, and she kicks it just over the crossbar. Pabian then sends a pass up ahead to number three, Taylor Stanley, and she lets one rip between two defenders, but Gaunt makes the easy save. The Eagles again on the attack, but Ingles sends it wide right. Sit away now with a scoring chance off the corner kick, and it's sent into the box, but Gaunt tracks it down. The Tars would get their last scoring chance of the game. But number 10, Natalie Beauchesnay, would continue the lockdown defense for Eisenhower. And the Eagles would fail to make up any ground in the standings as this game results in a nil-nil tie.